as you can see, the coloring is indicating the fascia and how bound fascia is. So the benefits of cupping, your fascia is a network system that moves four times faster than your nervous system. So that's pretty dang fast. Your nervous system connects body to brain, but your fascia connects muscle to muscle. So we used to think when you threw, let's say a baseball, you thought you used all your bicep, tricep, etc. Now we know you use portions of a whole bunch of muscles, but how do they know when to activate? Fascia, right? So it's like a telephone line throughout your whole body. The problem is through bad habits, not recovering, etc., a lot of times that fascia can become bound. And when it becomes bound, you're not getting, those muscles aren't receiving the proper input of like, hey, this is when to fire. So when it gets stuck together, it's kind of like saran wrap. And the best way to separate saran wrap is not massage techniques. Unfortunately, it's great with muscle fibers, um, but we don't do as well when it comes to separating fascia layers. And so the best way to do that is with quick blood circulation. So with the cupping, we're literally drawing blood to the surface very quickly, right? Um, and you get coloring because of that. Now, you can almost think that cupping leaves bruises, but the difference is, is when you nick let's say your thigh on a cabinet, you have warrior cells that come to that area very quickly. And that is the process of healing. And because they can't come so quickly, it creates that color. So same thing here, except we don't have an injury. We're just creating quick uh, blood flow to separate those fascia layers that are kind of bound like saran wrap. So the benefits is in here, it allows me to get into those muscle fibers because fascia surrounds everything and is essentially everything but cartilage and bone. I mean, doctors six years ago before we discovered it called it nothingness. They would cut right through it, right? And now you've not only cut your telephone line, you have scar tissue that builds and now you've got the Berlin Wall in your body basically. Yep. Um, so that's even harder to go back in and try to break up scar tissue, which is something that gua sha and cupping, that's what they do.